All right, this next one, I'm going to do uh, one of my favorite songs ever. Um, uh, yeah, The Nurse Who Loved Me. Uh, Perfect Circle's version of it is, is uh, beautiful. Uh, it, it, it's beautiful. That's all I'm really going to say about it. Maynard is Maynard. <laughs> um, the instruments they used in there are so unique and so cool with his voice. Um, I didn't realize that they weren't the ones that wrote that song until a little while after I was a big fan of it and um, in Failure, I, I discovered, wrote it and the original is more of a kind of guitar-oriented um, rock, grungy type feel. Uh, it's awesome. And that, and that listening to that kind of allowed me to figure out that it could be done on the guitar. And it's a very, in my opinion, a kind of a strange arrangement, but with the, with the way that the vocals are structured, it all works well together. It's just on paper it would look kind of to me like it wouldn't work, but it does. So uh, I'll do a quick rundown of the song after a quick, quickly play it. Um, what else about this one? Yeah, it's beautiful. I love, I've always been like hooked to the first line, you know, of <clears throat> say hello to the rugs topography. And uh, I'm like, okay, well, that sounds smart. What the fuck does that mean? And really, what you know, if you think about uh, the rug's topography, right? How are you going to get a, a view of the rug's topography while well, face down on the rug, right? And so, uh, and then the story begins to unfold about, uh, you know, our, our uh, let's call him protagonist in a uh, what appears or seems to be a, um, a hospital for the ill, uh, and uh, falling in love in the in the uh, strangest of circumstances, um, and how painfully um, comical that can be in a way. Um, yeah, it's, it's, it's fascinating. It's just, it's, it's just as serious as it is kind of humorous, talking about um, kind of the apples of your eye that you kind of like sneezed out while you're sleeping there and lack of consciousness. I, I read that as lack of consciousness um, causing the um, separation of uh, him from his loved ones, um, or, or the alienation of his loved ones from him. Uh, but then you get into some humor and like, you know, fucking she's got everything I need, uh, some pills in a little cup or, or pharmacy keys. Like that's good. That's good. Great stuff. So it's a real honor just to be able to play that song, to know how to play it and to, yeah, um, to have the guts to throw it up on YouTube. Yep. I just congratulated myself for doing a half-assed job of a really good song. All jokes aside, here we go with The Nurse Who Loved Me. We'll do kind of a mixed version of it. I can see it in 
got everything I need Pharmacy keys She acts just like a nurse With all the other guys Okay, not, not terrible. Um, hmm, what a song, man. So, okay, uh, fine. It's got like chills up my back there. That's beautiful. <clears throat> um, right, so the way this is played, there are this, I don't recall ever pulling off a tab for this song. I think I just kind of listened to Failure's version, or Failure's or the original version, and tried to mimic what I thought the chords were. I'm like 90% sure that's how I, I learned it, but I, I could be wrong. It was a little while ago. Anyway, the way I play it is <clears throat> I'm in drop D. I'm on the 11th fret, okay? And I'm just, uh, I'm doing you know how the drop Ds do that. Fucking, I don't know, like, like, like 11, 11, 11, fucking 13, 14, that kind of a structure. I don't know what you call that. It's like, it's like a major chord for a bar, for a uh, drop D power chord. Anyway, fucking say it. So, 11. Say five. Okay, those two just don't, you know, automatically sit together, but they do perfectly for this song. And then it just goes into a series of like one fret or two fret movements that you would think wouldn't really work, but they do. So it's like 11, five, six, four. Took me a little while to, to be okay with that. I don't know, maybe it's just a me thing. And then the chorus is, uh, uh, you're gonna go down to four. Seven, with me up to 11, down to six. All dressed in white, she's got everything I need. Keys. Okay, that's basically it. That's like, you could, you could muck around with that basic uh, foundation and pick how you want um, to make it feel good for you. That's basically it. Uh, you go through two kind of cycles of that, verse, chorus, verse, chorus, and then you uh, are into the bridge, which is essentially the uh, verse uh, chords played uh, in Failure's version really aggressively and Perfect Circle's version, um, it's like harps and shit, I don't know. But uh, that's basically it. Beautiful song. Thank you, uh, both Perfect Circle and uh, Failure. Um, yeah, yeah, definitely a really, really influential song for me. So um, let me know what you think. So, thanks again. Cheers.